Well, Terrence just got caught cheating. And he got caught on camera when his parents was there. She gathered his parents and him so that they could know the whole truth and nothing but the truth. So help her God. Check this video out. I just, he didn't even know. He, this is shocked to him. Check this out. That I know everything. Don't ask me what I'm talking about. Who is Shania Shah? See, this is when everything gets quiet. Who, when you hear first name and last name, who is who? You want to tell your father and them that you're pregnant? Oh. Terrence, you was just by she a little while ago and you went to drop a clear blue. I have videos of your beagle being there. I have pictures of the pregnancy test. God. Oh my God. You know, one thing about a woman, when she brings... When she brings you the truth, she has evidence. She has, she coming with evidence. That means she have done her research. She have done 78 hours of full research and another three years of studying. And she's ready to bring it. I have videos of you and she having sex in a hotel. I have everything. I have everything. Look at how he's Look at his chest. And anonymous informer mm. notified me of everything going on. I have pictures, mm. I have messages, I have videos. I have pictures of the pregnancy test. I know always go online when I buy and felicity with your family. I know she have a two-year-old child. I know she's a little girl. She's only 23 years old. I know where she live in. I know you just go there and play with your son. Look at how this man breathing. His chest, his shirt, everything is moving. He is still, he is quiet. Because all he can do is listen. At this point, all he can do is listen. Check, listen, look at this dude. And look how much proof does she how how much evidence does she need? She has every information on this other woman. I know she calling my son Papa and saying, and I know, I also know that when you drop me and mommy in the airport to go to Barbados. You carry my child by her house. Oh. My son. Y'all, brothers, we gotta stop doing this. These kids be talking, man. These kids be talking, y'all. Even if they can't speak yet, they speak. They tell. They tell on you quick. Daddy, and mama know exactly what he means too. Y'all be doing some, we, well, not y'all. We be doing some stupid stuff. Her house. I know everything. I know when you say you're working late, you know, working late, you're in a hotel with Chida, why you never have no money. <laughs> Just say that's why you never have any money. You know, that's one of the biggest signs that a man is cheating, when he's broke. When he's broke, he's always broke. He, a lot of times he's cheating because he's spending, listen, it's expensive to cheat, man. Gas, hotels, food, dates, it's expensive. While your main woman ain't getting a damn thing from you. What, what? Check this out. I was running in the ATM because you had to pay for hotel. I know she's lying with all, all your police partners and them. I know everything, Terrence. I know everything and I have the proof. Mm. So this is not assumptions. Mm. I have hard evidence mm. to prove everything. Mm. And I know that a couple months ago when you had something on your neck and I asked you what it is. You tell me how that the MP5 strap. And I know you tell she that you tell me is an MP5 strap and I believe it. This woman, this is not a funny matter. It's not funny at all. But she, she got him bugged. She got GPS. She got everything. She got that, she got that man stuff, his car, his clothes, his underwear. Everything is bugged. She knows exactly what he tells her, what she tells him, what she tells him, that he tells her. Golly, and you know what though? You know who probably rat him out? His boy. You know how I noticed? His same thing happened to me. You hear me? The same thing happened to me. That them, them dudes that we call our boys, they're messy, man. Them, man, I'm telling you all. And I know it was a hickey. Yeah. People say get hickeys. And name? I'm pretty sure it have others because the name when I see the message last two weeks ago when Tristan had my phone is a different name. So maybe it have other women too. Mm. I don't know. Maybe this is for them. I know but the one that I have proof, hard, cold mm. evidence about. Everything I have it. Mm. I 
I have everything. Mm. I don't know how you're going to deny it. Mm, There's true. nothing to deny. And I know you tell she that you're going to find some way to work around it since she's pregnant. Mm, okay. And she's a little girl. She's 23 years old. Dumbfounded too. You don't know what. Just look at his face. You know that boy get caught. Messing with a 23 year old girl. Listen, y'all better leave them young girls alone, man. Them 23 year old girls, they. You know what my ex wife told me once? She said, Kirk, you know, let me tell you something. You don't live to climb Mount Everest and don't tell nobody. That's what she told me. And that's when I was in my bad days because people would talk. She said, You don't get to climb Mount Everest. And don't tell nobody. You're going to tell everybody when you climb. If I'm messing with these young, these young girls, you ain't got shit to lose. You have a wife. Or the, listen, man, we got to stop doing this stupid stuff, man. That's all we lose to a good woman. Because you, <laughs> when you lose this right here. I know you know all she family is going by she house. Mm -hmm. I know everything. She living in like a kind of little shop. No, you're not a good house. But you are too happy. You don't pay a bill in this house. You don't make groceries. The only thing you just do is go penny wise and buy pampas with each other. You know, she said that he don't pay no bills in the house. You know, let me tell you something about the masculine. When a man lives in a place where he don't invest in, he don't spend money and he don't buy no bill. I mean, he don't pay no bills and stuff. He finds someone else because he will always feel insignificant. He will always feel less than his masculine energy will be very low so he will always find someone else who he can who can make him feel like a man he will find another woman that he needs to give to and do for so he can feel his masculine energy i'm telling you all you all be having these men who don't have no no kind of goals no desires no dreams no money nothing and you think that just because you do for them they're gonna always be there waiting for you that's not how it works when a man feels you know that type of when he's taking care of, when he's not deserving of it, shoot, he gonna find someone else to feel like he is like he deserved. I'm telling you all. You don't wash your clothes. Mm. You don't. You don't give me no money. Mm. Not that I need no money. Nothing. But you're too happy. I home here like a damn fool every day, taking care of my child, doing whatever I had to do for you. Look the other night when Tristan get up and he started vomit. And he was working in the night. And call me in the middle of the night to go and do your laundry. Because you had to go to court. I get up and do it. I had to stop the laundry because the child, after he vomit, he get trouble to go back to sleep. For over two hours. I still make sure and get it done by the time you come home. I know when you say you're working extra hours, you're not. I know everything. I know you had sex with you last week Thursday night. Yeah. Next, last week, Thursday night, she probably was right there too. Probably got set up. Dude, what you doing? She knows everyone. And she don't even, listen, when a woman knows all this information and don't say nothing about it, don't tell you, talking about she pray about it first before she told you, she done, man. I know everything, Terrence. Mm. And all this line Felicity, you know, kind of run down bar, so people there won't really know you. I know your police partner and them know. I know back and know. I call the names. I tell them all. I know it's everything, Terrence. Mm. Everything. And just last week, Friday, you watch me in my face and say you never step out on your marriage. Mm. And that the message I see is that it's just a stupid message. It could never be, never, never, never be a stupid message. But I bide my time. I bide my time to the Lord. I pray about this just last night, you know. The Lord send that anonymous person to contact me this morning to tell me everything just last mm -hmm. night i wouldn't lie for that that brother ain't said a word yet look at how he's staring he ain't said a word yet oh poor thing that dude ain't said nothing like what and i get to find out everything because i couldn't come and accuse you without proof and now i have everything and you have this little girl pregnant. She's 10 years younger than you, Terrence. She's a little girl. Boy. Okay, and she has a child already. And you go there and play with your two-year-old son. No, you want to know how she meets? 
Uncle Molly? His parents. Oh my God. Listen, man. We gotta stop doing this mess, man. We gotta stop doing this mess. Jesus. That boy got caught. I, and you know, when a woman have that much evidence, I don't know where she get them evidence. I don't know where you are, woman. You are woman be studying moves and behaviors for 48 years and before you are get a divorce. I don't understand this. You always stay with a man for 16 years just to make sure your assumption is right. So you will do your research, your studies, your following, your investigation stuff. But man, poor guy. I mean, I don't mean to say poor guy. That dude, he done. Oh, my Lord.